Black's challenge here is to kill white by forming a large eye shape that is a dead shape for white. So the most intuitive move would be this. Right? Otherwise, it seems like white can start a code like this very easily by playing at number two. So black might want to play this, forcing white to connect. Right? White can now play on the outside. Otherwise, black can cut here and kill these two white stones. Throwing in here doesn't work because black can capture first. And if white plays here, black can cut. If white connects here, black will connect back. So white's number two will definitely fail. So white can only connect here after number one. And this should be clear for black. All black needs to do now is to reduce white's eye space like this and threatening to connect back. White can only block here. And now the easy move is to play this, and this will be a bulky five shape for white, and white will be dead. The only thing that you need to know is that if black plays elsewhere, then white can live this way, right? Because now this 2-1 point will be forbidden for black. Black cannot come in here like this. And eventually, white will be able to capture black like this and will form two real eyes this way. That is why black's number five must play here first. And now white can only capture a bulky five at best and black can play this move to kill white. So overall, not a super complicated problem. If you're familiar with the bulky five shape, if you need a refresher on eye shapes, please check out chapter two on life and death on my channel. Good luck and thank you for watching.